In part one of this video, you learn that all Japanese candlesticks have a body and that most candlesticks also have tails. But how do these parts of a candle graphically represent a stock's price movement? Let's assume that this candle represents one day of trading. To the left of this candle, we have a simple line chart tracing the stock's behavior over the entire day. Looking at the line chart, we can see that the stock opens trade at a price of $20, drops to a low of $19.50, rises to a high of $21.20, and finally ends the day of trading with a close of $21. Now, let's examine the candle itself. We see a clear or white body, which means that the price closed up for the day. The opening price is represented by the base of the candle body, the close is marked by the top of the body, and the topping and bottoming tails indicate the day's high and low, respectively. In other words, this single Japanese candlestick has done a remarkable job of summarizing an entire day's worth of data from the line chart. Here's another Japanese candlestick. Let's assume that this candlestick also represents one day of trading. Notice that the body is filled with black this time. Looking at the line chart to the left of the candle, we can immediately see a graphic representation of stock prices trending downward over a day of trading. The stock opens the day at $21, peaks with the day's high of $21.20, drops to the day's low of $19.50, and closes the day of trade at $20. Returning to the candlestick, we see a black-filled body, which means that the price closed down for the day. Because the candle is black, we immediately understand that the opening price is represented by the top of the body. The closing price is marked by the bottom of the body, and that the two tails, topping and bottoming, show the day's high and low. Let's take a look at one more Japanese candlestick. When a stock's open and closing prices are identical, the candlestick will not be green or red or any other color because its body will shrink to becoming nothing more than a horizontal line, as you can see here. This candlestick is called a doji, and it indicates indecision, a perfect balance of power between buyers and sellers. In the line chart to the left of the candle, you can see that the opening and closing prices are the same, $20. The stock did not move around from a low of $19.50 to a high of $20.20, but in the end, it closed with no change. Without a doubt, Japanese candlesticks light the way for traders who know how to use them effectively. Thank you for watching our video. Before you go, we invite you to join the TradeNet trading team. Our professional analysts will teach you how you can trade stocks from your own home without risking your own money. Click here to learn more about our funded accounts program. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.